Hi, so I think people who watch the channel know that I can be a little obsessive about some things and at the moment I'm obsessing about bamboo. Um, and reasons for that obsession really are it's cheap, it's readily available, it's really strong, it's easy to work with hand tools and woodworking tools. You can bolt it, glue it or tie it with string. It's absolutely astounding. Now, when I think people think in the West, when we think of bamboo, is we think of this kind of thing. A little stick that you put in your garden to hold up, uh, I don't know, roses, grapes, flowers, whatever it is. That's what we think of. Now what I've got here is the same bamboo, it's the same species, right there. This is a four metre length bit of bamboo and it's absolutely amazing. Look at that, isn't that incredible? I mean, they use this stuff in the East to build bridges, water wheels, houses, all kinds of stuff are built out of this. This has a diameter at the bottom there of 130 millimeters. It's big as water pipe. It's incredible stuff, really. Now, I was thinking of all the things you can do with this, and I think there's just such a huge number of things. And to my mind, it's incredibly green. This is a renewable resource. This stuff grows really, really quickly. It's immensely strong, and it's really easy to work with. It's like any material. You have to work in the limitations of the material. What I thought I'd do with it is make some wind turbine blades. I mean, wind turbine blades out of bamboo, they've got to be an idea, haven't they? I was reading uh, an article actually about the renewability of wind turbine blades and it is kind of true that they're made out of balsa wood but the problem is it's only the core that's made out of balsa wood. The rest is fibreglass and resin and a lot of resin. And they were saying in this article that if you really wanted to be green then what you ought to look at is making your wind turbine blades out of wood. Now that's quite a lot of effort to do that, but it struck me, we've done wind turbine blades out of bits of pipe, and they were very successful. And this is nothing more than a natural bit of pipe, so we should be able to make wind turbine blades out of this, and that is exactly what we're going to try and do. So I'm going to take one metre sections, so that the blades will be roughly one metre, and split them. So first things first, let's cut this into one metre sections. So one of the cool things about bamboo is you don't cut it, you split it. I've got a bit of bar iron there that I've put a wedge onto, so it's not very sharp, but it doesn't need to be sharp, and you put that in the centre so that it's crossing halfway between. There we go. And we start that split and then we can continue that split by bashing it down until the whole thing splits in half. And we're going to split that in half so we get four half bits of bamboo at one metre in length. There we go, two halves. What we're basically doing is making a bamboo version of this. This I made from soil pipe for the easiest wind generator you'll ever make. We're making a larger bamboo version of this blade. Now, the original bamboo was 36 centimeters around, so I've divided that by three. So effectively, we're gonna have three blades out of one piece of bamboo. But unless you have a bamboo splitter, you can't split it to three, so I split it into half and we'll take a shaving off. Now, you do have a direction to this. It goes from top to bottom. You can recognize the top, because if you look at the nodes, the underneath node is sort of grayer and it's got lines in it and it's dirtier. The top node is always cleaner. Of course, we just took it out of the packet and the bottom's thicker and the top's thinner. So you can recognize the top really, really easily. And you mark off where you want to be and we can either use our ax or our splitting knife, make a notch in where you want to be. Now I'm looking for the hammer. There it is. Give it a start. 
and then tap it down. Splits beautifully. Now the nodes, we need to clean them off. We'll do a better job of that with a more um, delicate tool than a hand axe, but we need to split our other two because we want three pieces like that. Okay, so I sanded off the nodes so it's nice and flat, and now I need to cut the actual blade shape. So a third of the way down, it begins to narrow to half its distance, and that little bit there is one twentieth of the length of this. So we're going to cut that out. Now remember, bamboo has a terrible tendency to split. If I start here and go up there, chances are I'll get a split there. So you start there and go down there, and then the bamboo will come off beautifully. So after you've cut them out and given them a bit of a sand, this is what you end up with. So we've got three turbine blades that are actually really rather beautiful, even if I say so myself. Of course, like that, they're not a lot of use. We need to bolt them onto something. Okay, so here it is, bolted onto a little triangle. That little triangle we've used before in probably the easiest generator you'll ever make. Uh, Luke made an update version of that, and that's from him, because we have this radiator fan motor. So we've bolted the radiator fan motor onto this bit of pipe, we've bolted our blades onto the matching part that goes on there, now all we need to do is get it in some wind. Okay, so we've strapped our blades to a four metre long bamboo pole, there's our motor right there, we've got a bit of cable running down, and now we're going to try and hoist it up in the wind, see what we get. That's awesome! I mean, we've got a really gentle breeze, but then we do have a two metre swept area, remember, so it's a huge amount of area. I think we're getting 100, 200 belly volts out of it at that speed. Ah, not at that speed, we're not! But we're getting an occasional breeze, and as you've seen, it works just fine. Hopefully, the wind will pick up a little bit. Look at that, it really does go in the lightest of breezes. That's actually quite awesome. Yeah, that is. I can't even feel a breeze right now. Man, that, it, it, it's, a, it's a huge span here. Yeah, no, and it's, the trees aren't even moving, so it's a really light breeze. Oh, there are up there, just amazing. Okay, that was pretty awesome, really. I think we got about half a watt out of it, something like 1.82 meter wind speed. Not sure, don't really care. I think what we showed was you can make yourself a pretty decent wind turbine, actually, from nothing but some sticks of bamboo. And I thought that was very cool, because talk about renewable. Renewable and resources and renewable energy. What a win-win. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you very much for watching, and please remember to subscribe.